then uh, he just listened to a young girl who was saying that the black community here is totally very angry. So be very interested in this point at all. Yes, I'm going to listen to your voice. Some are empty. With too much meaning and riches to offer humankind. You know, after some of these earthly adventures and no more, one can still find footprints of these great lives on the pavements of our contemporary lives. Good evening, you're welcome to the program Green Planet. Good day, thank you very much for talking to people, places and events and to the African Center for Community and Development. What is your name, sir? My name is Ari Obed. And you are in Cameroon to coordinate um, a project or a program idea. What is it all about? It's called I Am Cameroon or Je suis le Cameroon. It is uh, a concept. It's a simple idea that we believe is, has the potential of transforming the country. A simple idea that simply says that each Cameroonian must accept and assume responsibility for the future of this country. So in a way it's some form of nationalism? In a way it absolutely it is. It, it's making us become a lot more patriotic, but not patriotic just for love of country, but patriotic for ownership of country. Now, you are working in the capacity of um, a JCI representative as well as probably a representative of other organizations. Can you try to throw light on some of your portfolio? Well, I, I currently serve as Deputy Secretary General of JCI. And for the number of years that I've been a member of JCI and worked for the organization, what I'm trying to do here is a clear example of what JCI members should turn out to be. JCI empowers young people to create positive change. And I think that it is through my experience that I've been empowered to believe in the ability of young people to transform their countries. And so what I'm doing here is really an exercise of the outcome of all the years of being a member of JCI. It's also going to serve as an example for all the other young people who are members of JCI or members of any association um, there is a saying uh, that you can never underestimate what a small group of committed young people can do because they can actually change the world. That's so the what, only thing that has to do. What are the challenges that you're facing so far in, in trying to harness this kind of strength in youths and probably the greater society? Mm. Challenges I knew there would always be because what we're trying to do is going to be difficult, it's going to be a long journey. So I know that there are challenges, and, and various challenges. Um, people always wait to see how an initiative succeeds before they come on board. So that's an obvious challenge. Um, you know, people do not always want to be committed to a, a new idea. People are always suspicious of something new. People do not even believe in the fact that they could be changed in this country. So all of that are challenges that we face. But what is the opportunity that I see is that whatever, as I've traveled across this country and spoken to people, at every level we have something in common. There is need for change. Somebody has to do something. And we may try this and we may not succeed. But at the end of the day, we would have done something. That's really what the idea is. Do something. Don't just blame others. Take action. So what are you going to be talking about today and uh, uh, what scale of um, invitees are you expecting in the ceremony today? 
Well, we're going to have a wide range of happy invitees today. We send out several invitations um, across the city. Um, we have people who have come all the way from here, they are Douala to be part of, of this. We have people who come from Nui and Tiko and all the uh, neighboring cities to be here. Uh, today, basically, we're going to try to put the idea in their hands. So this is not an idea that belongs to Ari Obensi. It should belong to each one of us. So I have no ownership of the idea. If anything, I want people to take ownership of the idea so that as they leave this conference room, they are going to be saying to themselves that I am Cameroon. I've got to do something about the future of this country. Thank you. Thank very you very much, much for talking to people, places and events and to the African Center for Community and Development. And I wish you good luck in your wonderful endeavors towards empowering people in Cameroon Thank and you. Africa. Thank you very much. Also, be very interested in this point at all. Thank you. With too much meaning and riches to offer humankind. You know, after some of these earthly adventures and more, one can still find footprints of these big lives on the pavements of our contemporary lives. Good evening, you're welcome to the program Green Planet.